Good morning guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm talking a bit quiet because it's 8.30 and everyone's still asleep so and I'm enjoying the quiet. Um, just sitting at the table, just had some brekkie, just had some scrambled eggs with some avocado toast. Traced a lot. As you can see the decorations are off, Jade started doing that for me. Oh, that's the worst part about decorating Christmas, isn't it? Packing it all away. Fun, fun. But, um, yeah, I thought I'd do a daily vlog today. Um, hope you all had a good new year. Yeah, we're going over my sister-in-law's today and they've got this wicked smoker. This is my pork. I'm actually really happy with this. I got it from Coles. I didn't pay $29.95 for it. I actually got it half price. I had a sticker on but I ripped it off before. Well, I've had this soaking on and off in the sink um, with water in it and changing it every 20, any 20, every 20 minutes. I'm going to make a bit of a marinade to um, yeah, rub all over it, brush all over it. Spicy barbecue, Audi sauce. And just when you think you can't get enough sugar out of that sauce, I'm going to add some brown sugar. And that's about it. Yeah, I'm thinking I might put some chilli on it too. I reckon that'd be beautiful. I think James would love it too. Big moussaka for my sister-in-law's house. Got some buns. We had plenty buns earlier. Got some spots from Aldi. Has has been washing that many dishes. We're just gonna cook some corn. Has has got a potato bake in the oven. And I'll show you the smoker. This is the smoker. Yeah, my brother-in-law, my sister-in-law got. That's what I can show you in a second. Pretty cool. Can you go to the top there? It smells so good. It's from the Weber. Yeah, see what is it? Thermometer. It's got like six points. One, two, three, four. Nice. Oh, yes, we can have. So it tells you, yeah. All little probes. Stabbed into all your different mates. These are the probes that you stick in there. Yep. And when they get to a certain temperature, mm. he's got a Bluetooth to his phone. Yeah. And it tells it that when the meat's ready, cool. you pull it out and then you let it rest for a couple of hours. So is it resting from that? This is a fireplace. Oh yeah. Beautiful. Just in my pantry, I just took um, a few more books out of here. These are all my cookbooks. So what I've done is 
this is the only one I've gone through so far. And I've put all different little tags in there. For, um, and I've just put little tags in there. I've just grabbed another three out, so I'm gonna sit down and have a look through those. I wanna try to new try to cook a new recipe every week or maybe every second week. Depends how much time I've got really and yeah, I wanna sort of go with still what I have in the house. Work as a base for that, so but I've got this one out. I haven't cooked anything from this yet. This one's actually got a few tags in it already. Oh, it says Christmas. No one doesn't say anything. Um, but Women's Weekly, sugar free. So this one looks pretty good. And I've got Donna Hay, I've got her big book out. Never really cooked anything out of hers. Nothing's really taken my eye. And I grabbed Gordon Ramsay's book out. I love Gordon Ramsay's recipes. Cooked a lot of his food and never been disappointed. So if you want a good cookbook, definitely recommend what, um, one of his ones. Yeah, I'm like just sitting there. I've got all, well not all, the stuff off the shelf thing there. we will wrapped all later. I can't be bothered at the moment, so I want to sit down and have some me time and do some more of these. I'll show you what I've cooked out of this when I get to it too. Um, yeah, really, really good. Okay, just got back from the shop. I've got Scarlet wrapping up my Christmas stuff down that end. And then I've got all my shopping. I'll show you what I bought. From Aldi, of course. I've uh, got some eggs, two dozen. Got some noodles. I don't buy those very often for kids and they haven't had them for a while. So I probably miss them grab just a couple for lunch. There's your lunch there, babe. You've sell some what to have. You got these, yeah. remember? I pop the kettle on. Um, got some of these salsa, little salsa dips. These are really good when I do burritos. So I'm just going to have them in there on hand. Got a couple more rice cream. The other day I got one for Hutto and Scarlet. These ones are for the old boys. Got some tins of tuna, some pasta sauce, uh, just some salad, some leaves, and some rocket. Uh, what have we got here? Just some bags, small, medium and large Ziploc bags, crackers. Hudson, can you go sit down and eat that please? Thank you. Um, more noodles. And they've got muffins, couldn't they got to work. Um, they've got muffins at Aldi as well now. So they're like two pieces for a pack, so it's not bad. Got triple chop muffin mix and blueberry. That's all right. Scarlett, can you stop it, please? It's not funny. I've uh, got some crackers, a block of cheese, some ham, some chicken breast. got a big garlic bread. I've got my daughter coming over tonight and my grandson. I'll tell you about that in a minute. Um, so I've got these chicken... I just wanted something quick and easy for tonight because I don't want to be in the kitchen all night. So I so just go I'll grab these. They're chicken schnitzels, they're just parmigiana style. And we're just going to put some of the pasta sauce on there and we're going to just do some. Um, yeah, we're just going to do some chicken parmigianas with garlic bread and some salad. I'm going to do a potato bake as well. A um, couple of things of plain flour, some more crackers down there, caster sugar. Two banana bread mixes. I've got lots of bananas that need to be used in the bowl there. Pretty black. Uh, capsicums, bananas, two things of cherry tomatoes, a couple of little cucumbers, purple onions and avocados, bicarb soda. I've been going through so much this stuff, been cleaning everything with it. It's so good. I've uh, got some mushrooms, some milk, and I've got these little things of cream marked down as well. And in here, and I also grabbed some sun cream, some tropical strength repellent, uh, some more spray, and here's the moon. Needed some more deodorant, so we have that. Um, and I also I bought some of these like mint choc drumsticks, pretty much. So I had over to see one of those getting all over his mush. Hi everyone. So I said to you before that I was going to tell you that we are Granny and Granddad. Finally, <laughs> we got mommy and daddy over this side. If I can get this in, 
And the main. Here comes Uncle. Star of the show. Uncle Hot. Uncle Hot Eye. Go eat your salad. Go and eat your salad. Good boy. And then we got this little guy. Big Look. And he was born on New Year's Day. And he was £8.3. Or £4. Three? Four. four. Oh, I said three. Yeah. Uh -huh. His first grandchild on both sides. Yeah. So we're not doing that, neither baby. Thanks, darling. Mm -hmm. no. He's beautiful. Let me turn the camera around. So he was eight pound three. And his name's Cooper. And we're still yet to decide on his middle name. It's the great debate at the moment in Australia. He's absolutely beautiful. Again, he loves him. He's got Talia's mouth. He's like Talia. In her ultrasound pictures, I'll, add, I'll put them in the vlog so you can have a look. He looks like his mummy in the 3D. Is it 3D or 3D? 4D. Yeah. But he doesn't have mummy's nose. He's got mummy's mouth. Oh, oh look. <laughs> so beautiful. But he's like his, he's like his dad from nose up and his mum. There, down. Fart slot, <laughs> both of them. <laughs> <laughs> Always hungry, <laughs> like Dad. <laughs> Don't touch his head, Danny. Don't touch his head. Always hungry. He probably won't. Yeah. Look at him. No! No, you can't get him. They're just such time wasters. Just want to look at them all day. Mm. So beautiful. No. We plan on going to bed early and then it's 11 o'clock and I'm like, bedtime. Yeah. Yeah, fully on. Yep. Yeah.